Greetings everyone. For me, it has been almost, almost a year and like six, seven months. 561 days. This is the life of my account, the Gazelle account. What I wanted to talk about today is the amount of crystals I have gotten for my studio. You know, you have a closet studio. And I wanted to finally, finally upgrade my statue to the level 130. I'm not a well, I'm, I'm literally at the current moment even a small spender. Like big spenders usually go for 5,000 a month or 3,000, 5,000 even more. But for myself, I am limiting my total spending into 800 on this game. So I am really very careful in what to pick or what to buy. And today I am finally able to almost not not today, maybe next week, I'll be able to finally get my last skill and upgrade and finally get to unlock the final skill, which is increases the troop damage. Now there are many methods to earn crystals, of course. And I consider one of the best methods is the Fort Wars. Surprisingly, I have checked many of my friends' accounts, didn't really pay much attention to it. But the best, the best item in the whole, in the whole game that is still easily farmable is the crystals from the night shop. Now we are in the battle 7 which means we still have one more battle until this event is over. So what I usually do is I get the Ancient Relic and the Titan Crystals, but of course I'm getting more Titan Crystals because the game gives you more Ancient Relics by default. Like if you pay attention to your Fiend, you will see that your Fiend, the Monster Fiend, rewards the weekly one gives you actually a decent amount of relics here it gives you 670 and each 20 is one relic and of course the reward is really decent even if you are uh, top 30 in the lines it doesn't matter the rewards are really decent so for me since i'm taking it so slow titan crystals is always the issue so if you are wondering during this almost two years how much did I have or how much did I buy? I usually only buy the first two bundles and not every week. I only wait until the good bundle shows up for the crystals and get the first two. It's rarely for me to go for the third one, but I reached the point that I'm finally almost getting the final upgrade and I would be able to show you the final crystal upgrade. So how much would it actually cost me in terms of the crystals? and uh, relics. For relics, I never bought any. During this whole life, I never bought any. If you are like playing Fort Wars, if you are participating in uh, uh, what you call the events and daily Monster Fiend, you will be getting a lot of these crystals, by the way, and relics. So how much would it cost? If we try to reset, you will see that I have over those two years 125,000 and when it comes to the relics, I have 4,570. This is the total amount that I own on those two years and that I have used at the moment. As I said, I'm not a big spender. I'm not even a mid spender at the moment. I'm like, could say, uh, between the low spenders and mid spender, like 500 or up to 800 a month. And I was able to reach this. So what I will be upgrading next, I will go for the either mage or my defense because defense is one of the rarest stats in the game and the last upgrade for me would cost an extra 3200 crystals for me to upgrade it so literally you need around 128,000 crystals to be able to max out two skills to level 25 and the rest of course will stop at 20, then you will be able to get an 8%, 8.8% to your whole army. 
Keep in mind that troop damage itself will affect your angels and literally the whole troop type, which is really decent. How do I always gather my crystals? Daily fiend, when I do daily fiend, and sometimes I always get it from Benita. Benita. It's all I always do the 20 times reset in here, and there is a chance it will show up in one of these events. The crystal balls, and then I would definitely buy all of them. And of course, I buy the rest from the defense command, the infinity tower. I don't care really about anything else, I always get this. And I get some obsidian steel, and I get the titan crystals, that's it for me. And I train some troops, I think you get around 60. Yeah, 60, you get 60 per week from those. And if you unlock the monster fiend, you will be able to get 42 a day. Every attack will reward you with a 40, with uh, 21 per attack, which is 42 per day. And that's, I believe, a really decent amount. There is one more trick I do. So right now in Fortress War, and uh, Fortress War, we are in the Battle 7. Okay, so what I do is, I save up these night badges from the Battle 7 and the Battle 8. And after that, the season and the entire shop will reset. As soon as the shop reset, I go to the night shop again and buy the Titan Crystals. And then again wait and buy another 4,000 from here. And that would really give you a big head start. Uh, keep in mind, I think the 1,000 only or 1,200 costs more than $100. If you check here in the bundles, It gives you like uh, 1,500 crystals. That's it guys and have a wonderful day.